Press box and stadium seating has made a huge difference to our program. You know, the players who are currently here, when they show up to practice or games, they just are so excited every day to get out here. It's, it really is one of the nicest facilities now in Division Three baseball. We want to uh, identify one uh, individual and family, actually, who was uh, at the forefront, took a leadership role in helping us get this started, and that's the Raffle family. We have Mark Raffles here, who's going to throw out the first pick. We're real excited to have this new location because what we used to work with before was just a card table and if it rained or was windy it was terrible and often uh, you know, it would be a, it was a double header, the guys would be wrapped in blankets trying to stay warm so we're nice to be able to be in here where we've got all the technology we need to make a connection and our audio out of here is much better so it's, it's really great. The brick on this is brick that Principia had in its storage area out by Snyder's barn. We had the brick for 16 years. So we had that out there and we realized, you know, instead of picking a brick uh, for this, maybe we can use materials on site. It was perfect color and I, th and I thought a perfect match for, for this project. And someone had mentioned, and this and called it a stadium. There are only 74 seats here, but it's really, uh, really a neat space and it feels like a stadium. I think it, not only for our players, our current players, but also our current uh, students on campus and the faculty and everybody on campus, it just makes for a really nice venue for people to come out on Tuesday nights and Friday nights and Saturdays and, and watch some good quality baseball. And the home games that we've played so far this year, they've been packed. So. Fans got to get here early if they want to get a seat. 